Colchester Triumph 2000. Uh, we've just finished this machine off. We've fitted the DRO. So that's the console. Here's the X axis scale all fitted. And there's the Z all fitted on the back there. So that's all good. I'll just show you it working now. So as I turn the handle, see so it reads on the X there. And the same if I move the Z handle, remove it like that, it's reading on the Z. And we've checked that for accuracy as well. It's accurate, it's a five micron system. Okay, so firing the final lathe up, uh, you need to have the guard down, because there's a switch just there, that needs to be operated by the guard. You see that? Okay, uh, this back panel needs to be on, because there's a secret switch under there, that needs to be on as well. Then when all that's good, make sure you're not in gear here. Make sure your gears match, so the colours need to match. So the yellow is the 350 there, make sure they all match. Okay, and then you can fire this button up here. Okay, light lathe fires up. To start the spindle, push this one down. Runs good. Move the lathe this way. Okay, engage feed. See this feed and on its own. I can swap the direction by pushing this one. See now it feeds the other way. I can also swap this one like that. That feeds that one. Swap the direction again. It feeds there. And you also see it moving, you see it moving on the DRO. Okay, to change the spindle speed you must stop first. Okay, put it on to 600. Fire it up again. It's not being quiet. The shafts are all spinning. You can change that with these here. Okay, shut it down, press the stop. Obviously there's a load of other ranges to go through, but uh, we won't go through those now, I'll make the video too long. Uh, just to note, this is the coolant pump. You hear the coolant pump running in the background, that's to turn the coolant pump off. Okay, so, very little to do now, it's almost ready to go, absolutely beautiful. We've serviced all the, uh, all the gearbox down here and put all the all new oil in, so it's looking really good. Mm -hmm.